Okay, good. Styles change over the years, and that's a given, and we all allow that. And we know. But you're making an entrance, right? So I would say, and I'm not, I didn't warm up like you. So <laughs> littler steps and more time. Little steps, little steps, little steps, little steps. Surprise. Here, stop. Big port de bras, bum, 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 and finish. Bum, 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 bum. Breath, one, and two. Then you have to travel more on the first lift. Okay. Travel, and I never did a développé. No. no. <laughs> the only time I did développé was after the nine. Okay. You know, later, way later. Yeah. And then I did a big old one. But until then, no, 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 no. It's the girls' show. So here, balance, you have to travel more on this. Way, way, and then I stayed here. Balance, so that she stepped into me. I got all the way back to center. And I really did. I mean it. I'm not just. Yeah, and I and I sort of did. I matched her here. Then I caught up her with her here. And I'm not just having memory nostalgia. I'm saying we really had to do that. And then after I put her down from this side, I stayed here, right? So we did balance, balance, step to stay, right? No developé here. I just got behind her on this, and travel at least there. All right. I just stepped, I just stepped. Mm -hmm. That's right. <clears throat> she, Mimi did the devil face. <laughs> I did, so can that, I just that's what I did behind can you Can I now. just say something about yeah, the no, what entrance? Yeah, what did you do? No, just about the entrance. When you come running on, what, what John was saying was yeah. very accurate in, in the, the acceleration and the speed of the steps. And you're really presenting yourself to the audience that one, it's a little bit here I am at that one moment. From that point on, the entire piece is windswept and you're not playing to the audience at all. You're so caught up in the swirl and whirlwind of the music, the, the radiance, the passion, the, you know, all of this that needs to be physical. So you've come in, you've presented yourself, you come down, and this is here. And on that br silence, this is something you remember. I think I, I thought it was going to be my last breath. <laughs> I, I went, oh. And I used to actually oh. hear her do that. In front. Not at all. Once, once, you, once you've presented yourself, you just get right into the music. Okay. And then take a breath. <gasps> and then, yeah. phew. And now, then really move on that. Now, a technical thing. I don't know how they teach it now. But for Mr. B in class, and generally speaking, one is down. So it's not typically on one. It's one and two and a three right. and four and a five and a one and a two. That's the same. I mean, exactly. This, I'm not sure where your one is. I can't tell if your one is down or if your one is up. It's sort of just all motion. Okay. <clears throat> one and two and a three and four and a five and a one and, and two right. and so you go down soft you know don't get crazy but down and an and balance it. and remember that there's going to be a difference between the small steps the tiny allegro steps yeah. that you do and these steps this is quick but it's not stop yum bum 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 you know okay. extend yourself Jerry. Now the next okay. thing of this entrance. Okay. After you travel like hell to put her down in the Padasha, now this is the same step she does. There's no sauté behind her. Yeah. <clears throat> so, balance. I used to watch Mimi so I could stay in the same slight diagonal. I used to really focus on her. She used to travel like hell, and so I had to keep up with her. <clears throat> so, all right. And what she was saying, we were noticing that before. Yeah, everything is played too much to the audience. We, I mean, we, the only time I looked at the audience is before my solo. Basically. Otherwise, I was looking first there, that, or down, whatever, but not to the audience. So why don't you do it? And then travel like hell, keep in the same diagonal. And when she did the foite, I used to be exactly where I need to be. So after the balance, you do the foite or best. So I'd be exactly where I need to be, see what I mean? To pick her up and move back a little bit. Okay. Same thing on this thing. I used to get, travel to get on this direction diagonally, so I was exactly where I needed to be. So she didn't have to worry about it. She could just do arabesque and I'd be right there, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly what she does. Okay. And travel. <clears throat> Without music, maybe. Six and seven and eight. Coupe one and two and three and four and five and six and travel and two. Travel, Jared, three. That's a, yeah, yeah, that's right. Try to stay so you're just a little bit diagonally. That's already better. I, I like that better. Oh, of course. 
Yeah. So remember, it's this. So we can see it. Exactly. Mattress. And it, just you balance don't, it. You don't need to lift it too high, but maybe just cross. That. It should be demi point. It's not the demi. It's the it can be dim. Point. Did so you do dim your point? On point. Okay. And then. But it, was, it looked a little, yeah. a little Dutch. Yeah, that that was a, that was a little too much. Okay. You know, it's it's not it's not a big step. It's you want to do that entrance again? Can we do that entrance? Again? Is that right? Just that much again, but with the corrections. Okay. Okay. Just let them go. Okay. Balanchine once had a class where he came into class. It was just a typical company class, and he was didn't like the way everybody was standing. So he said, you know, you can come in and stand, and nobody will see you. You'll be invisible. Or you can come in and stand, and everybody will go, wow, who's that? And we're all, you know, it's, you know, 11 o'clock when we used to have class. So we're all sitting there, what is he lecturing? But anyway, he said, now I'll show you. And it was in, it was in when the school was in Juilliard. So the whole company was there. So he walks in the door very meekly. And he walks over the piano. And he goes, you see, nobody saw me. So then he comes, he goes, now this is how you do it. Then he came in, he walked in the room, he walks over the piano. Like, and everybody saw. So that's the same thing for this. You make your entrance so that everybody has to see you. I mean, I liked it better, personal opinion. Much better. He used to schedule this on matinees. I don't know why, but he, we did this so often on matinees, and I think he did it to wake the audience up. <laughs> you know, we were like the appetizer, like the shrimp cocktail or something. I mean, it was like, first thing, 1 o'clock Sunday. So you have to do that, you know, on your entrance. And Mimi and I both said at the same time, I think you still can travel more from there to there on that sauté balancé balancé. When you come A little to bit the more. side. Yeah, if you let it down from the pot of shot, at least just the side of quarter, that'd be fine. Okay. But we, in my day, we never looked at quarter marks or center. We just got a feeling for it. We okay. never, we never looked down. Go and go and go and go and go and down and go and go and go and up and down That's and it. down. Right. That's it. That's it. I didn't lift her so high on that, you know, just to make sure the tempo was correct. That's good. Yeah, I have a feeling you're thinking of going up. Don't. Yeah. Not so much. But that was better. It's, it's just good, like the wind. Megan. And the more you reach out, the more you're going to be feeling that. Don't pull, pull under. Just push from the back leg. That's, That's it. Excellent. Yeah, every step. And he used to give that in class a lot. A lot of steps that were just steps to make you move. You know, the, every step was a step that's bigger than you think you can do. Anyway. So now his solo. Now. I don't, I mean, there is a video of me doing it in 73, so I may be putting my foot in my mouth. Because, yeah. But I don't remember doing, a, I don't think I did, a slow port de bras at the end of the cabrioles. Uh -huh. Maybe I did. I mean, I haven't looked at that video in years. But I don't think it should be because the girls behind you have a step. And I think it, you fight the choreography if you're like pat, buttering the bacon. He <laughs> used to say buttering the bacon. All these things come back to me now that I'm back in New York. You know. So I used to finish and hold it while the girls did their beret down. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, I mean, just, you know. But, and this is a double, right? Oh, you no, didn't? No. no I, th I, I thought that was you marking. I know I did. I no, it's a double. Front, back, and down. No. Police. All right, so a little bit before his thing. So it's, you, ba, 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 Finish, so the girls had their da, 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 Finish, so the girls had their da, da, da. Now I used to finish on center for the assemblée. That I did look for Robert, the conductor. I saw him right, hello, Robert, <laughs> up in here. Then I just did a little, and I travel here so that I can go off in the air in the passe. Up, right, then I just did one arm on that. I'm here and I gave a little lean, well, I gave a little lean and one. Uh, that's right. 
<clears throat> and definitely I remember, because it used to hurt like hell, you have to get off in the air like Tarantella, except on the other side. <laughs> so you go traveling backwards. Bye-bye. So a little bit before his. to stop is because the girls had this nice little beret down. And you're like moving, you know. Yeah. So. Those pauses are invaluable. The, the moments of stillness yeah, are no, very it, important. Yeah, me and I were saying in general, that's why I asked you if it was, it was, a, new, if it was a style of the company is doing now. Everything just to me personally, this is just personal. Everything blurred because everything was lyrical. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's great to be lyrical, but then sometimes you want to be staccato. Sometimes you want to have like a you know, a picture, yeah. you know, and not, not the old Russian style of every step is a picture, but you know what I mean. I mean, you yeah. want to have a contrast in your dancing. So everything is just isn't soft and lyrical and the audience goes to sleep. focusing when you do the first okay I would take my arms up yeah okay don't look into the audience okay so you've got this and then step step now I didn't do this but I was right here here and here and not so sharp okay you know, get there quickly and on time, but maybe not accent with the, yeah, a little bit, you know, less. Open, in, up. Open, in, up. Yeah, okay. like that. And then go on from there because this, okay. You run back mm -hmm. right to the corner. And the first step is balance to the corner, balance to the side, big développé, balance to the corner, balance forward, forward this way, okay. big and head, turn your back. Do so I just travel back then? A bit. Here I go. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. So what your run? takes you to the corner okay. and then you take the diagonal and, and you really push from the back like reach travel on it now travel travel and move now avoid the mirror avoid the mirror avoid the mirror I still see you watching <laughs> do it once with do it once facing this is the front okay. you've got no mirror go step out step out now step back step out go right and go back and go yeah that's it <laughs> yeah. I'm so sorry i think that's a different style. no that's the idea that's it is uh the arms here yeah and then right here 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 and bend and then this leg reaches to that corner. Okay. Right? So the run just the run just takes you right to the corner. Okay. You know, and that's your direction. That's a much better line. 
Now run like crazy here. Go. Run, 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 run. And reach. That's it. Go. Reach. Go. Move. Right. Go. Move. Yes. And go. Right. Back. Ooh. All right. Stop. Excellent. So there's I'm no tired. there's no B plus that you're used to before that balance A. Yeah. You're still going because ah, you're yeah. used to the B plus. Okay. You okay. just run into it. Okay. Excellent. Now, what you looked front Damn. just near the end. Yeah. Where was it? Do you remember? I you know. did the three, the diagonal, yeah. and you went here. Now here on this tour jeté. Yeah. Is it this way? No, this way. This way. Go back. Woo. Yeah, I feel like okay. someone's done this. Okay. Same so, way. yeah. And, yeah, don't position yourself. Throw yourself into it and move, right? Uh, and I guess maybe that was the place where I saw you look straight front. There. Let your head go back. Yeah. Okay. Okay. One more time. That was, that was beautiful. Okay, just take a break. Just know that that was right, just right. Okay. Just right. Okay. Now, when I came out, I don't think I did this. I just think I did this. But that's a minor thing, you know. And then I remember I turned left. And then I remember, but I'm not sure. I, mean, I remember going over her arm for some reason, not under. Well, not, not like that. She runs in the center. Da -da -da. Let's stop here. Sorry. Do you want to? No, you're well, you're with me. I don't even remember this. Well, I, I, you, 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 now you're making it harder than it is. <laughs> so after the, um, I remember the second time. Let me. Well, it was Mimi's thing. Is after this she'd go here, here to. I'd stay there, and now she. I remember she stayed open, and then on the shoulder. Now I don't know. Maybe I'm getting confused oh, yeah. with some of the other girls because I. Into the I did it. No, 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 no. No, it, there's a lean forward on him. I mean, yeah. I, it, there has to be. Just, yeah, just, but just I remember solidified. distinctly you doing, or maybe, see, again, I did it with so many different people. From here, you did the first one here, and then, you just stayed. So, so she got sort of almost weird, and then from here, there was a I, quickness. I don't recall that. Don't recall that. I don't recall that. Still yes. Still ends up like that. But I put my hand on the shoulder. Well, you stayed open. I'm not, maybe I'm not being clear. The second side here, which is one and two, and then that's where you put the hand on the shoulder. I do. Yeah. Okay. One and two, and then around. One, two, three, two, two, three, two, two, three. This, this one I went towards her, so that so that when she does this next thing, I used to do it just with one hand on the promenade, one hand on the promenade. Now you start on one, two, three. no, you do go from the promenade. You go one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two. So she's opposite you on the second one. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Now that is a change of the choreography. One hand and one, two, three, two, two, three, three. She goes up on three, right? Yeah. She goes three. I'm up here. You go up on three. One, two, three, one. That standpoint, standpoint. That's the right idea. 
Do you have the arm up on all those first PKs or normal? To me, it looks funny. Yeah, I think it's normal. Jared and Megan on those first PKs even, not up, but normal. And then bring it up for the pirouette. Also, just, just, a, just a technical thing, not choreography. For your line, after this, this arm should be here, not there. That's right, so you match each other. Just you know, flat across, Megan, flat across to him. So it's, the, yeah, because before you were just sort of going. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Same thing. Four, five, freeze. Better. That's right, now arm up. And finish. One, two, three, one. Stay there, Jared, stay there. Passe. And finish. One, two, three, two, two, three. Attitude. Almost. <laughs> Is okay. she doing that right? Is she doing that right? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. The 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 pause, the moment of stillness in between these moments are it's very important. That's why I said so finish it. Quick okay. stop. Absolutely no no movement at all. Alright, so da 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 freeze. Boom, that I'm, and not such a big sota. I don't remember killing myself there. I remember that was stopped, and this is just easy. Slight. Mark this, because you got you know so much more. So mark that. This is better with the arm down, because then we have a difference between down and up for the pirouette. Freeze. One, two, three. Here. And what I was saying is don't move. When she does this second one. No, I'll do finish the pirouette. That's right. She comes to me on this. I just stay here. Now she goes one, and I just stayed. Now I did that, then I did that, and I did that. You know what I mean? You're, you're moving with her, which, which misses what I used to love. Sure, it was Mimi that did this, was this little moment of that. Try it. If he remembers it, try it. <laughs> well, I remember because I thought it was so clever of Mr. Balanchine to put that little in. I used to, are you sure she's starting at the right count? I think she is. Okay, I mean, do I without the music for a minute. Because sure. it wasn't that hard. So from the attitude going around, so he goes and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, six and seven, seven, and eight. eight. Try one other thing, just try going up on uh, one, two, two, on three, two, three. Do it, do it one third later, one, three later. He goes and one, two, three, two. Now you go three, three two, two, three, three, four, two, three, three, five, two, three, six. six that's three, right. Three, two, three, three, eight, two, three. One, two, three, two, two, three. Now you wait. Now you still go up on three. That's that's it. That's it, right? That's it. That, yeah, because the first time, the, uh, the first time is we're doing the attitude at the same time, right? He goes one, two, three, two, two, three. You join him three, two, three. Four. Second time he does one, two, three, two, two, three. You go up on three while he's going down on three. Okay. It's called choreography. That's right. Now, ideally, if you ever have rehearsal time, which in my day we never did, you probably don't either, right? You never have time to rehearse anything. Well, then you have to do it on your own. So, which means you have to watch each other so you match the attitude so you're in the same line. I know it's a lot to ask, but he goes here. All right. So, here. Oh, wait, I'm doing something wrong. Anyway, bump, 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 bump. Yeah, that's right. Then to her. So, that the last, the third one, you should be in the same line okay. of the attitude, ideally. Then she does her balance A. She takes a little force. You get her high on the back, is where I used to do it. And then one, two, three, two, two, three. She goes three, two, three, four, two, three, five, two, three, six, two, three. I used to just really concentrate on this and freeze for a minute. That you establish that pose. Then the girls come in on big step side, big step back. Run around. Now I used to definitely finish on the one to present the girls. Don't, da, 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 they start their attitude. So you go, voila. Is that a single to punching? Yeah. I go around once. Once. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, tw
Right. Okay. Megan, watch in your fourth position so that you don't get your back arm too high. Well, no, not so much your shoulder. Yeah, but, uh, but also when you drop back, it's you, you're usually here. Drop it. Okay. So, that's it. So that you've got this nice, beautiful connection. Okay. It's like a general rule. It's like a general rule that one arm, I mean, the two arms would be one arm diagonal. You know, it's just, you know that. It's 11.30 in the morning. Leave me alone. <laughs> Same thing last time. Big step side. Back, big, big steps, big, 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 big. Run like hell. Go. And run. And finish. There they are. No need to. I don't recall the looking at you at that moment. Do you? Now run to get behind her. Run, run, run. And go. Good. That's better. Uh, run in, don't glee saw it in or anything like that. Just run it, because you got the four girls right on the front of you. Now, on the videotape, I had to do a two-year tape because there was the, we didn't have wings. So if you don't get confused, there was a videotape done in 73. Okay. But, don't, but that, there were, it was in Berlin, and there were no wings, and so Balanchine had to do a two-year tape. Okay. But there is no two-year tape. So you just run in, bum, 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 bum. And I, you really sell it there, bum. Now, this travels as much as you can. This is right, this is right, this is right. Don't look, down, don't look front on the brise. Look over. I had it on. I had it round. Okay. Da da da, I look front on that, but not now. And my big thing, and everybody has to do it on the one. One, two, three, four, five, six, one. Not one, two, three, anytime, but on the one. One, two, no, and this is second air basket, unfortunately. I know, I hate it too, but that's what it was. One, two, three, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, one. Yeah, but not such a big air basket. You don't have to have such a big air basket. have better arm. Stay, 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 stay. One, two, three, four, five, six, one. Yeah, and the same thing over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, one. Stay. No, 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 no. That's what I mean about everything's too lyrical. Okay. Lyrical, bang. Lyrical, bang. <laughs> And stay. And one. That's better. No, stop. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry, but it's, I don't want you to keep. That's better, because this is this is easy. This is easy. This is easy. This is easy. And all of a sudden, stay. And one, two, three. This is easy. Stay. Now this is devil pay here, and unfortunately, it's a devil to pay here. Quasi, not attitude. Not my day. We do attitude. We do so many of those anyway. Later, uh, you know, you know. So. Devil pay. Yeah. Devil pay. Yeah. It's a it's a oh, devil pay. A face in a round. It, but it's not a round de jambe. So it's not like an attitude. And down. That's it's oh. just devil pay quasi. Devil pay and down. Fifth in the air glissade. Fifth in the air glissade. Fifth in the air glissade. Little jeté. Big jeté. Step 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 one. Uh huh. Little and split, and land on one, two, three, uh, land on one, two, three, four, five, six, one. You'll do it. You'll, you'll do it right. But bum bum bum. Stay and land and stay and land and stay. It's hell, but there's no coupe chasse for it. It's the same thing. And the step, and you should be on center, not too far front, because you have the four girls, and you don't back up. Sorry, you don't, you, 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 da, 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 da. the second half, one, two, three, four, you know, the, the second, last. Fifth, fifth, the other leg, fifth, 
four, five, six, say, land and stay, land and stay, land, stay, land, another one, stay, land, step forward, right. That was right. That was right. Yeah. Quick right foot. foot front, left foot front, right foot front. Yeah, if you can try to gather your legs together more quickly and actually take that and move it. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> and, you, and you don't try to take one step forward. After your last bronze chute, you come down on your left leg. Just take one step forward. Now we have the girls. You look at this one. Da 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 da. This one. Da, da. And don't move back. Don't just, you know, you'll have to get used to that. Da, da, da. Now you move forward on this next one. That's right, chute. You move forward because you've got to get out of the box of the girls. That's right. And this is off the first wing. Foite. Big chasse. Big tour chute. No, tour chute. Tour chute. Not a, not a, uh, no. So after this, <laughs> foite, tourjete, I used to split, which is vulgar, but he didn't stop me, so I figured that's what he wanted. So big split, and then I used to go whoosh, off into the wings, like a back bend. So you run on, uh -huh. and I thought it was with your back to the audience. Here. Okay. Looking up at your hand, and then you step right away okay. onto the point, right? Keep the back arm low, and look up into that palm of the hand and the attitude. Look up. No, not in the front. Avoid the front. D look directly. Up. And now, big step and up. That's it. Okay. So try just that step. And cross and fist. Head down and up. Avoid the front. Yeah. Down and up. And then again. Eyes up. And step. And up. Eyes down and up. Now, small. Doesn't have to be high. Okay. And go step back. One, two, not too much of this. Two, three. One, two, three, and back. Right? Is this front? Here. Right, and then here's what I would do from this back. I would leave your head behind, but again, don't that's it. Right, and then then go on. Okay, start here. Low as low as you can and now round the arm instead of being up and down like this round and round and round and then look under like really curve in the torso look under open the arm open it and then go to the other side round it round it eyes up and now really torso bend but on the bend, you're looking under the arm, under it, and then it opens, right? And then go again, round it, round it. Now the third one is gonna make you fall back. 
but make that fall happen from the extension of the back leg and the toe and let your body literally fall until you have to catch up with your feet okay. as you run back. Two, now stretch the back leg. Okay, now let me see you do that with your Two. Now take a breath. <gasps> yeah, but don't come off point. Let go from point and back. Yeah. So let let you let just go off balance oh. from point. Okay. Take a breath. Let me see. Here you breathe. <gasps> oh God. <laughs> Fall back. One and two and breathe and stay and. On point. So is now, it a don't do a circle. Category? Yeah. Well, I mean, it's it's little runs it's like in a, six, uh, six position. Oh. But you hardly put weight on your yeah. toes. Do you know? What? Do it on the diet. That was better. Remember to look under, over, and up. Okay. Right. <laughs> Yeah, okay. it, it, it's, it's, it's nothing much but focusing on the hand that's working. Okay. okay. Did you do the circle with the arms here? Do you want to try it that way? I remember an open jeté, but try, try it if it's more comfortable. Yeah, I think I could. Is it yeah, more comfortable? Okay. Make the front leg quick. Okay. Quick batmo. I'll try it with third. I did, I like, I did an so open position, but that's okay. Same place, maybe, the sure. three? Under and unfold, right, good, and nice. Look under and unfold, good. Go. Front leg, faster, front leg. And up, that's it, okay, yeah. yeah say it, I know, no. you know what I'm trying to get. Yeah. You just have to hit that position, and you're still being too clear. You're hitting the leg, and the arms are coming after. Right, so have everything freeze. has to freeze in the air. Photograph. He used to say photograph all the time on jumps. Snap. Go. That's right. And stay. Beautiful. beautiful. And beautiful. Now run and just get there to go. And one. Up. Whatever it was, that was a beautiful circle. <laughs> so you've done this, and step here, and go. I would suggest, Megan, because uh, just on that last diagonal, because you're going to be a little puffed, anticipate the beat. Yeah. Anticipate everything. Right yeah. That well, the circle looks gorgeous. Beautiful. You're, you really have elevation now. Okay. Because when you stop in the air like that, you really can see that see you're it. jumping. <laughs> Otherwise, it's sort of like. And the position. Beautiful. Great. Yeah. And then on the, just on that, take a big breath and then anticipate the beat just a hair. Because this time you're like half a beat behind. Yeah. Okay. Balancing anecdote. He used to say one, he said it only one time I remember, but um, I, I remembered it because it was great. He said, the music is like a horse. You should ride on top of it, not have it pull you like a chariot. So you ride the music on top of the beat, not ahead of it, but on top of it, not let the music pull you. Never forget that. Should I do the, the end? How Maybe do just you, the diagonal. Just the diagonal. Okay. Remember to look over the leg, over and up. There's real movement in the upper body at that point. Arch your back. Stay. Nah, you can do better than that. I mean, it's really kamikaze time at that point. Bum, ba, 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 and that goes fifth back, back, right foot back, and then switch it on the plie. That's right. Right. 
So he's running. This is definitely this. Boy presents the hands, and you tap. Tap. That's right. And the left and hand down a little lower. And they're lower. Yeah. Lower. Lower. Yeah, not too high. You present. Hello. And she goes, hello yourself. So that was good. I didn't do a pose over there. You can if you want. Just the six steps going back. I just finished in B+. Plus. <laughs> and took a big breath. Yeah. And then, um, but that was right. Bum, ba, 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 stay. Ba, 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 bum. Da, da, fourth. You can do three or four pirouettes as long as you finish. Bum, 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 bang. Dynamics, dynamics. And then she comes out. That's Megan, do you come out and pose before you start the ton levé? I don't think so. No. Okay, you don't. I, because I don't think you do. And I thought that. You don't look like a I thought you came out and did something. Okay, okay. But in fact, you, you start that right away. You, right, in the wings, and the ton levé is. Oh, okay. Right. No, I ran out. Okay, I'll start with the wings. In the 70s, we had long hair. So what I did was, when I made my entrance, come with your back to the audience, Jared, and you make your circle with your back to the audience, and then you face front. So feel like you have long hair. Now it's face front as you come around. That's right, that's right. That's why I mentioned the long hair. Feel like it's a Breck commercial or that old shampoo. Remember Breck? <laughs> they don't know Breck. It's an old shampoo, and the girls always had long, flowing hair. So we had long hair. So it's like run out. You know, you don't have to like look back, but feel like you've got the wind in your hair, and you're rushing, and then you finish to the audience, and then really fight for that poire de poisson. You know, real old-fashioned bluebird step. On your crossing. Don't look back at him. Oh, no. On the, no, on the first crossing. On the, you know, on the Tolavé, under, Tolavé up, under, and then balance, balance. Now reverse that feeling, and you're here, and now you're back, back, back. Okay. Looking up at your hand. So it's like little attitudes in the back. Instead of. You know, you've done this, front yeah. attitude, now really do a back attitude. And now lean back against it. <laughs> lean back against it. So it's just the reverse of what you've done in shape. Look under, back, back. Back, 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 that's it, right. So after the devil okay. I try to be right behind her so we got we get sort of this kind of action going, you know, like Barocco a little bit. Like, oh yeah, nice. Barocco action. Chasse. I used to barely get her here. And so I didn't. Okay, really... just one thing really quickly. Yeah. No, Sorry. no, just the arms. On the very first Yeah. Yeah, it's here. Your hands are here. And you're looking back. And then they open. I have a photograph of us doing this. Yes, that's why, that's why I'm saying. <laughs> it just came back to me. So it's here. Beauty and the Beast. Here. And then it's Chasse. open. 
and then I just gave her a little shove. Not right. Much. Second, oh, second time you go in front of her. This is a repeat. Pardon? No, no, he just runs in front of you. You run around yourself. You just turn around yourself and pose. That's right. And he does PK5, hold six. That's right. I mean, if you can. A little late. See what on I, the yeah, you, you the can start to be behind the beat. Dum, bum. Up. Up. You're, you're also, it's just running. Ton levé, balancé, run, 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 run. Ton levé, balancé, run. You're like doing an extra something. Tap. Just mark it. Tap it. Um, this thing at the end, maybe notice the hand thing. So after the um, thing, I used to step this way, so I was open no. just a little bit. Then I turned around here, and I brought the hand over, and then I stepped so that really that way. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's right. Make sure that after you've done the turn to fifth, mm -hmm. there's a real pause there. Day. and absolute nothing, nothing happens until the music starts. And then very slowly, because it, it gets slow at that point, yeah. start moving. Yeah. Now you can melt and round the top on. Round it, that's it. Okay. Yeah, and really bend. And then when you bend this way, you know, bend down and bend and whatever you do, right? Yeah, just slow it all down. Well, it depends on it depends on the stage too. But I mean, but you start at the impulse on one, and the two, and the three, and the four. Yeah. Nine. Well, she she did. <laughs> I I did something different. She did something different. I never. Knew and that. I thought John did the same thing, but it doesn't. I mean, it's not, it's neither here nor there. This is you know, it was the run forward. Yum bum 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 bum. Yum bum bum yum bum yum. That's what I did. But John doesn't remember that. I never that. knew you did that. <laughs> but I did that. <laughs> it was sort of right on the, you know, musically it felt right. Nine. So obviously the two of you have to do the same thing. <laughs> I know I did that because I wanted to get maximum elevation. And right. If I stopped here and then did the glissade, I wouldn't have as much momentum. So you just <laughs> need to pick what you want to do, both of you. <laughs> but one thing I want to do, I want to get this thing right first. <laughs> well, do, do whatever Mimi tells you. <laughs> you do what I tell you, you do what Mimi does. Um, the, uh, after the nine, uh, the tap again, yeah. I just want to make sure their feet are together. Um, and. See, it comes out the right foot. There you go. See, it comes out on the right foot. That's it. See, so, and she should do the same thing. Yeah. Da 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 all about the steps. <laughs> Let's try that with music so you can see how fast those little steps are. It's easier once you get it because you keep your momentum going. Yeah. That's right, Jerry. Six. Okay, stop. 
See what I mean? You have, you start to do that hesitation. You know what I mean? I mean, you got the, the old habit. But if you just keep the feet going, it's not any harder. It just keeps the rhythm, yeah. and then you have room. You too, Megan. Keep it going till the end repeat. until you do Five, the tall of eight. Six. Yeah. It's perfect. It's balancing choreography. It's always perfect. Before the um, boom, 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 boom. And plie one, two, three, and do one, two, finish.
So I think one of the really interesting things about Val's fantasy is, um, is the music and the fact that Balanchine used this score, I think, four or five times, I think starting in the early 1930s, you know, up until the piece that you worked on today. And I th I'm not sure, but I think that he used this score more times, it was a repeat, I think, more than any other score during his lifetime. Well, he liked to do things until he got them right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so luckily he got it right, because then he had, didn't redo it after us. That's true. Yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it is gorgeous music. And I know, Mimi, yesterday you said something about how much you liked the music, and then you quoted somebody. Pushkin? What did he say? Um, radiant sorrow is how he described the music. Mm -hmm. That was his quote for the music. I think it was Volkov that was uh, writing an article about the music, about uh -huh. Glinka. Uh -huh. And talking Isn't about... There sensual in there, too? Uh, passion, passion. Passion. Sensual. Mm -hmm. Contained passion. That's one of your specialties, I think. Contained you think? Passion. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> we should talk about speed uh, and stamina. To how... This is a very general question, but how do you manage the stamina issue in, in Vols Fantasy? But basically the stamina is just a uh, question of just doing it over and over and over, full out, don't hold back. He always used to say, what are you saving for? Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it, it, it's not like a bank. You can't save and have energy that, to call on later. It's you have to. Yeah. Repetition. Just like an athlete, any athlete, mm -hmm. same thing. Right. And you, Mimi, did you have any stamina issues with... Oh, big issues. <laughs> <laughs> I would do a run through and then when I was tired I would run through it again mm -hmm. so that it would um, feel like a pleasure when I actually performed it. Yeah. Did it feel like it looked like a pleasure when oh, you performed it? It was. I mean not that we still didn't get ex tired mm -hmm. from it but uh, in fact mm -hmm. it was much easier. Yeah. Well I like that. I like the challenge of getting tired because if you accomplished it I mean, I don't know about your roles, but in, in some of the killer roles that he did for Valella, which I sort of inherited, most all of them, just to get through it, you know, we sort of felt, okay, you know, you deserved your paycheck. Mm -hmm. um, but if you could really feel like you nailed it, which meant that the dancer had to take our own responsibility, you can't rely on the ballet master. City Ballet has many, many performances. Mm -hmm. There's not, never enough time for rehearsal. So is it, uh, if you have a solo, you have to take your own time, mm -hmm. grab a cassette or a pianist and do what you need to do, mm -hmm. you know, but those were the days that are the, the good memories when you feel I accomplished something. I, I wrote down here I was going to ask you about speed, but then when I was watching you work with these dancers, I thought, well, it's not really speed, it's, um, it's riding the horse, it's that anticipating, it's being on top. Mm -hmm. Mimi, you were saying, and go, you know, and you really... You have to Tried go. Tried to pu push her, push her a little bit. Yeah. You know? And one needs that help sometimes in mm -hmm. rehearsal. Mm hmm Oh, sure. I mean, y you can give it to yourself at some point, but it's nice to initially have somebody push you to keep going, keep going, keep going, yeah. and eventually... Mm hmm And to be a little ahead. It. I mean, mm -hmm. just a little on top. I mean, that really counts here. Well, the, the thing was is that he, he, in his classes, I always go back to his classes, because all of Balanchine's choreography, if you, you can't do it right if you don't have the class. But um, it's not a question of fast or slow, because he would give very slow combinations in class. Some of the adagios went on forever. I mean, depended on the day, but he wasn't just all about speed. But you have to be able to dance the right tempo of the music, because music comes first. Mm -hmm. and, and a lot of music is really meant to be played quickly, yeah. and he would never slow anything down. He was always a stickler for uh, the tempo markings from the composer, which necessitated the dancers having a technique to keep up with it. Mm -hmm. But you have to be speedy without looking rushed, yeah. which is the trick. You can't, which is why this dancing on top of the beat is important because he had, a lot of times he wanted the dancers to dance quite ahead of the beat so they didn't look like they were tired mm -hmm. and they got used to it mm -hmm. so that by the time you got into performance, you would be really right on top of yeah. the music, not yeah. behind it, not ahead of it, just on top of it. You know, which gave the company such a bite. Yeah. Today, in the coaching today, uh, what I noticed was that it's not and one, it's one. Mm -hmm. It's that, you know, really being on top of it. And I was sort of trying to feel that in my own body and realizing that, that my, my inclination, I'm not a dancer, is that I want, it, I want the and before the one. I don't want to go for that one. And 
Did you work on that in class? I mean, that, that sort of, that dynamic. Yeah, there's a joke about it because he goes, and one, and one, and one. He wouldn't say one, two, three, four. It'd be like, and a one, and a one, or a one. And, you know, it was, it was always the equality of the beat, mm -hmm. not one, two, three, four, or one. It was like every beat was, you know, equality. Balanchine a lot of times would have the pianist just play a chord, and then we'd have to do the tondus, the frappes. But what the point of that was not just to have a chord and for us to do it was that the frappe or the tondu or whatever the exercise was kept the inner beat. Mm -hmm. So even if the pianist just played chord, one, two, three, chord, one, two, three, yeah, but not chord, whatever we felt, no. which I've seen happen. And people say play the chord. It's not the chord. It's what's in between the chord, chord. and that we had to have in our bodies in the bar, these are tondus at the bar, frappes at the bar, grand papmas in the center, and eventually you do that enough every day. We taught six days a week in our time, and so, you know, you do that every day, then when it gets to choreography or ballets, you already have that mm -hmm. sense of rhythm and I mean, that urgency. You see that in the little uh, circle, when they're running in the circle, mm -hmm. the, the importance of keeping, keeping the beat as they run. What about the, the, the question of the glissade? You wanted a quicker glissade. It's, it's the technique of the glissade. So it's not a question of quicker. It's a, it, your feet work quicker, but you don't do it faster. <sighs> do you understand what I mean? In other words, the second, feet work. The second leg. The second leg is better. The second also leg the first coming one in. To, yeah, the, the first and the second work, coming in. The feet have to work fast, but you can do them fast and still stay in tempo. So even if it's slow, you still get up into position fast. Uh -huh. No, it's a beautiful little thing. I mean, it's not, I mean, it is a little thing, it's short, but um, it is, it is, I'm, you know, I'm really glad that it's still around, because uh, I think it's one of those things that could get lost in the shuffle. Very easy, yeah. But, you know, it's, it's you know, well, it's, it's like it's still going. Kids, it's underappreciated because you have to really commit yourself to selling it and understanding it's a big, important ballet, mm -hmm. even though it's only seven minutes long. Yeah. I mean, if it's danced with that kind of intent, it's just as important as Tchaikovsky Par Tantella, but it has to be danced yeah. because it's Glinka, it's Tool, it can look old fashioned, it can look, you know, a little banal if it's danced without the commitment. But if you it dance it. It has to have a dynamic quality. And they did great. I and mean, they, they were, were getting it. About his classes and how important they are. He actually felt his teaching yeah. was more important than his choreography and would, may go on longer. Yeah. I used to argue with him about that a lot because I said, no. I said, your ballets are going to go on forever. Yeah. But his point was, well, yeah, but they'll be changed. They'll, he even said this in mm -hmm. numerous interviews. But the basics will be. The, ba the steps will be there. He says this, you know, I mean, it's on tape, you know, that uh, different people will rehearse them. Different people will coach them. They'll be different. Yeah. The know. idea will be lost. The idea will be lost, which is why I really am so happy that this archive no, project. No, because happened. you bring back the idea. You and know, I've learned you a lot. Get I've watched it. some of the tapes of Alicia yeah. Lonzo coaching yes, the theme. Yes. And, and, uh, Marie Jean coaching Barocco, and I'm like, wow. Yeah. And it's great to have that, yeah. even though you don't want the ballets danced as a museum piece. But if you just do the steps correctly, even with some of the ways he's changed them himself over the years, you still get the essence of Balanchine, and it works brilliantly. I have one little question about um, Vals Fantasy that I remember very well about Mimi. Um, and I think it's, it's the solo with the jetés around the stage. And you're in the wings, right? So you were able to see this. So well, maybe I mean, after I got my stamina, yeah. Back, right. The first few you, seasons, you I was like <laughs> leaning over, yeah. right? Um, I remember those jetés as being absolutely extraordinary, and I remember that there was it was almost like electricity, and there was a kind of an intensity, almost a fierceness to it, and you just went zooming around the stage. When I got to that particular point in the ballet, yeah. and I had the entire state theater to cover by myself, mm -hmm. to that music with the a jump, I I just was thrilled to yeah. to have that opportunity, and I I think I just took it by the reins and just went for it, you know, and I just I had a great time. Yeah, I really you know enjoyed about contained it. passion. Now I'm thinking that that was maybe a moment of contained passion. I don't know if it was contained. <laughs> it didn't feel it was contained. Con no, but maybe, it maybe was contained because it was fast. It was fast, right. So that contains right. it a little bit. And the passion was in that energy that right. you had. Well, I mean, it was a joy to do as a ballet. Mm -hmm. and the music really spoke to me. Yeah. And so the fact that he chose it and allowed me to dance to it, you know, and choreographed uh, that piece was a real 
privilege, really. I saw a little inkling of your of your jetés today when you were telling Megan to in the jetés to really move that leg out. The front, the front the leg. Front leg. As quick as it is, there is a moment where you do get the full picture of the body in the air mm -hmm. before you start, to, you know, the next, the next. Uh, but it was the thrust of it. It was the, the thrust force. of the front leg. Well, now that comes from balance. Mm -hmm. That comes from a développé, or you know, a battement, or you know, all the the accenting and the dynamic of the movement that he would um, insist on in class sometimes, mm -hmm. and so that translates to the jump and you know many other it was things. amazing oh well thank <laughs> you I, I i enjoyed it and john in rehearsal you talked about a balancing jet jeté for the boys for the boys yeah. is that too technical to get into or is it well balancing used to say that that nijinsky and i also talked to um an older um dancer that had seen a lot of the the nijinsky dance and Balanchine said the same thing, that it wasn't that he jumped so high, but it was the illusion in the air that made you think he was jumping so high. So what Balanchine would teach us in class for Grand Chetés, and I, I remember distinctly because when I first joined the company, I thought I had a big jump. Huh. And, and um, he deconstructed the way I was taught to do Grand Chetés, which was a Grand Batman, jump up as high as you can to that leg, and the other one will follow, and then you come down. Because he said, because what you see is you see the, the up and the over, you don't see the stop in the air. So he proceeded to really tear apart the Grand Chate, and I was the lucky recipient of this, because mm -hmm. he never would say this in class before. He just would tell you to do them. And he explained precisely how you bought mom the front leg, but not so high, really, mm -hmm. that it would knock you over. Mm -hmm. uh, that you would go up, lock the legs, and not split. Mm -hmm. Later, you could do the splits if you wanted, but, but lock them in a very small V. Um, work on elevation, not traveling, and he would have us also land sometimes on two legs. I won't get up and do it, but you jump and you land on sort of two legs. Mm -hmm. And this is what I was trying to help Jared with, because Jared was obviously in the Grand Chabotman arabesque. And therefore, you don't get the stop in the air. Mm -hmm. You don't get this, this hesitation, mm -hmm. this complete float mm -hmm. idea. How long did it take him to make this ballet? Do you, do you remember? Mm -hmm. I don't remember, but, but I don't think too long. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't think it was too difficult. I do remember that at the, I, maybe it was the first rehearsal when he was starting the ballet. Um, after my first entrance, he asked me if I thought I could go on. And I, think, I said something like, I think I need to pause here. So he said, OK, that's fine. I'll bring the boy in. So he was wondering if I could sustain more you know running around and jumping at that mm -hmm. point mm -hmm. and I didn't think I could and he he just said okay I'll bring John in or John Prince in, whoever he John. was worried John Prince <laughs> like right yeah. um, I don't think it took him very long yeah. but he was always like that though. you see he was always I mean when he would do a new ballet his habit normally was to go up to whoever he was thinking about casting as the lead and say, you know, I have an idea for New Valley. Do, do you think you want to do? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a good accent, a good invitation. Well, <laughs> we all got it. <laughs> but it was interesting that he would go up. I mean, he said this to me, you know, when he did, uh, say, the scherzo in uh, suite number three, which he did for me in Marnie. And he came up to me and he said, you know, do you, do you think you'd like to do? How, why would he ask anybody if they wanted to be in one of his ballets? Right. But he just felt that this was Well, a courtly or nice behavior. I mean, it just used to blow me away. Mm -hmm. You know, it was just so respectful. And he would say this, you know, well, maybe, he said choreographing should be like Verdi writing an aria. He used to use Verdi a lot. Yes. He said Verdi was a master of knowing when to give the soprano a rest mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and when to bring in the chorus or when to, you know. So this, what Mimi says, absolutely, totally in character. He would do, he would just always, and he would ask the dancer, you know, maybe you dress that minimum. And you know, if you did, you said, yeah, I think I'm dying. Or if you didn't, you didn't. But he would ask you, yeah. can you imagine? <laughs> Well, we love Mr. B, and we love the company, mm -hmm. and so I think you know it's the glory of our lives. Basically, we were able to work with him and be there in that epoch, in that mm -hmm. period. Very lucky. Extremely lucky.